Hey, this is Danny Goki. You're listening to Keep the Faith, and together each week, you can help make encouragement become contagious simply by sharing how faith has made a difference in your life. So call anytime at 800-726-4150. 800-726-4150. The number is also at keepthefaith.com. I wanted to share a story that happened a couple years ago. I'm a hairstylist for seniors, and one of my ladies, who has been one of my clients for a couple of years, had to move from our assisted living home back with her daughter. She had a heart problem and had heart surgery and had to move upstairs in her daughter's house. Well, she became very depressed because she's a people person and had to stay upstairs and couldn't get downstairs to see anybody anymore. So she wouldn't see anyone, not even her pastor, and refused to see me and any of her friends. I kept calling her daughter saying, please, won't you just let me come and see her? Well, she slipped into a major depression and it tried to take her life a couple of times. Finally, her daughter called me and said, you can, you can see her when you want. That day, it was pouring down rain, and I told my husband, I said, for some reason, I feel an urgency to go see her today. So I drove. It took me an hour and a half in the rain. And when I got to see her, she looked 15 years older. She said, how did you know to see me today? She pulled back her covers and she showed me a knife that she was going to use to try to take her life. I said, I just felt like the Lord was telling me to come and see you today. And I told her that God's not finished with her yet, that He still had a purpose for her life. And she eventually moved to a little house and moved in with five other ladies. I kept going and reading her stories. Slowly but surely, she kept coming out of it. And she today is a light in her house. She is an inspiration to every woman there and prays for everyone. So just never give up on people. Just listen to the Lord's prompting. He will let you know what to do. 